Hi, I'm Naomi Kyle and this is IGN Space News. The Orange Xenia plant, which is part of NASA's plant growth system on board the International Space Station, is finally flowering. The experiment began on November 16, 2015, when the Xenia's rooting pillows were activated by NASA astronaut Jell Lindgren. The zinnias, which are part of the sunflower family, weren't looking too good in late December, according to Kelly. So he proposed a plan to restructure the flower's care, involving the astronauts taking on more responsibility. Kelly said, you know, I think if we're going to Mars and we were growing stuff, we would be responsible for deciding when the stuff needed water. Kind of like in my backyard. I look at it and say, oh, maybe I should water the grass today. I think this is how this should be handled. The previous protocol was dropped and the gardening team on Earth established new guidelines for the astronauts known as the Zinnia Care Guide for the On-Orbit Gardener. The Care Guide put forth new streamlined instructions geared towards an autonomous gardener. Kelly's Zinnias began blooming on January 12th, soon after the new protocol was initiated, making it the first Zinnia flower grown on the ISS. It's particularly important for NASA to figure out how plants behave in microgravity as deep space astronauts will have to grow their own food in the future. According to The Verge, the flower may not actually be the first to bloom in space. Apparently, astronaut Don Petit had a sunflower on board the ISS, though it seemed to struggle a bit. For all your space news, stay tuned to IGN.